Grandma, I'm home. Ah, sweetie. You haven't been visiting often since you became a hunter. Did you miss me? Of course. Oh, something smells good. Is it roast pork? Oh, I've learned how to cook a new dish. Would you like to try it? What happened to the pipsqueak who wouldn't even pour me a glass of water? Work has changed you. I should have talked you into becoming a hunter sooner. Caleb? I thought I wouldn't see you until tomorrow at least. What's wrong with coming home early to spend some time with you and Gran? Wash your hands. Let's eat. How's your health, Grandma? Still getting headaches? Oh, it's normal for people at my age to get them. I'm already used to it. I'll be fine, as long as I take my medication. But didn't the doctor say you should be hospitalized for observation? Are you sure the meds will be enough? Oh, I just got out of the hospital. It's too crowded and noisy, and that won't help with my migraines. Already a worrywart? You can rely on me to handle the family stuff. I've submitted an application form for a long-term care ward. It's safe, quiet, everything's been taken care of. Wait, when did this happen? And why didn't you tell me? <laughs> oh, Caleb, a decisive man as always. I didn't know about this either. If I need to stay in a hospital, you should visit me, all right? You can talk with Zane, have lunch with him too, perhaps. Well, he's really busy, so... Even the world's the busiest guy has to eat. When I haven't seen him in a long the time. Will we should invite him over for dinner, right? Declaring the area and we can no kidnap zone. him if he refuses. Now, here's a message from... There have been many explosions recently throughout Lincoln City. The Hunters Association has concluded these incidents are connected to wanderers. So far, 22 have been wounded. With no casualties, we advise all citizens to be careful when outside. Explosions, huh? Hey, Pipsqueak, news. have there been yes, a lot of active a wanderers lately? From the world Evol kind of, Evol Medical but it's fine. Lincoln has us. The Deep Space Hunters of today know what they're doing. Well, even so, you shouldn't push yourself too hard, my dear. And be sure to be careful during your missions. I know, but I'll be fine, Grandma. My Evol works well against wanderers. Besides, missions are often done in pairs. If... If we get hurt, we have backup. Even if that's true, your safety is always the number one priority in whatever mission you take. Your evil is great, I'm not arguing that, but who's to say it'll protect you all the time? Huh? There are wanderers in the neighborhood? Weird. I need to check it out. Grandma, Caleb, something's going on outside. I'm gonna take a look. Be back soon, promise. Hey, wait up. I'm coming with you. Caleb, what kind of hunter lets their childhood friend tag along to work with them? I'm not tagging along with you, Pipsqueak. Just heading to the store for some vinegar and whatnot. All right then. Well, we're just about to turn the corner. Go to the store and pick up your vinegar. Oh, and another thing. Better not walk out and start following me when my back is turned. Yeah, yeah, secret mission, blah, blah, blah. Can't let unauthorized personnel in on the details. Hurry up and go already. Also, I want some snacks. And fruit. Take all the time you need. <laughs> I don't sense any fluctuations. I'll just walk around for a bit. I see you're actually smart. Too bad. 
I don't have time to play around. Why are you staring off into space? Mission's over. <laughs> Did you find any big bad wanderers? Uh... The fluctuations disappeared. Probably a false alarm. A false alarm. Uh, Caleb, what are you... If it really was, then what's this? Oh, uh, I was petting a cat Got and... scratched by another stray cat, huh? I think maybe I should go find that cat so I can avenge you. Caleb, don't. Come on. Grandma's waiting for us back at home. Caleb... I was telling the truth. It was just an accident. You and Grandma have enough to deal with. I understand you want to hide it from Gran. We've caused her enough trouble since she brought us up together. Now that she's older, it wouldn't be a good idea to make her anxious. But why do you have to hide it from me? Can't you trust me now that we're all grown up? I don't want you worrying about me. It's not often you get to come home these days, so ruining the mood is the last thing I want to do. Also, I'm a grown-up now. I need to be the one making sure I stay safe. You can't protect me forever. <sighs> Why is that a problem? If not me, who could you possibly turn to if- <sighs> What's wrong? You wouldn't understand even if I told you, Pipsqueak. Forget it. Hmm. We've been outside for too long. Grand's going to be worried. You're doing it again. Go inside by yourself. I'm not your sidekick. Fine. But uh, hide the blood on your sleeve before heading inside. Since you're a grown-up now, I won't cover for you this time. After an injection of protocor energy, the success rate of clinical treatments dramatically improves. In other news, in recent months, the number of wanderers in Lincoln has increased due to the fluctuations of Metaflux. Metaflux-related explosions have currently left 35 people wounded with two casualties in Bloomshore District. We advise all citizens to be careful. Uh, what are you doing here? I thought you were out on a mission again. Yeah, I'll clock out soon. I just finished reading these reports. I'll turn them in in a second. You're working so hard. Handling all these missions and investigating Metaflux incidents? I refuse to believe what happened to me was just an accident. I'm worried about you. How about... We grab something to eat. My treat. 
Captain, I'll send you the report soon. Thank you. I just got one about a protocore analysis. Who sent it? Oh, yes. Sorry about that. That was uh, me. You okay? Uh, I bet you haven't gotten enough sleep. Rest. And don't be too hard on yourself. I'm fine, Tara. Besides, I wouldn't dare fall asleep when... Hi there. Just calling to remind you, you have an appointment today. Dr. Grayson? You had a transapical metaflux ablation last month, right? Dr. Zane has your medical report, but you'll need to get an evolved cardiac examination first. Okay. Zane... He'll be worried if I don't go. Captain... Take care of your health first. Then, you'll have the energy to do other things. These are the results of your medical examination. Everything is ready for you. You can visit your doctor now. Hello, um, my doctor is Dr. Zane. Is he available right now? Follow me. Because of the recent Wanderer attacks, Dr. Zane has been working overtime. Emergency operation in OR3. Call Grayson, stat. On it. Patient is elderly male. Prepare the pump for cardiopulmonary bypass. Yes, of course. <sighs> oh, I'm sorry. He's just very busy right now. Can you wait here for a bit if you're not in a hurry? It's fine. The operation is more important. Thank you. Leading expert in the study of protocol syndrome, appointed chief surgeon. Zane must be working overtime right now because more wanderers are attacking people. Oh, our shift's finally over. Do you want to get some hot pot? Oh, can't. I promised my granny we'd have dinner together later. together like before <sighs> why the long face pipsqueak i'm just going to aerospace academy shouldn't you be happy but it's all the way in Sky Haven. What if I suddenly crave your braised chicken wings? Oh, don't be too sad. He'll be back for the holidays. And when he is, I'll make him cook for you every day. Which means there's a reward for being your free personal chef. What is it? A send-off gift? <laughs> Who says don't I got Don't think you? I haven't noticed you being all sneaky these past few days. I know what you've been doing. Caleb, that's cheating. You can't just use your evil to take it. <laughs> I knew it'd be in a style you really like. Won't you put it on for me? No way, don't you have hands? No, I don't. Hurry, the train is about to leave. <laughs> if I see it's not with you next time, you'll be sorry. Sorry, Zane. I must have fallen asleep while waiting for you. 
You do realize it is 11 p.m., right? I had to move you because you wouldn't wake up after three attempts. I've been busy with missions. I do believe that there is a follow-up plan listed on your discharge summary. I suppose you didn't notice. I... If I don't busy myself, then... I'll think of that day. I've been dreaming about them. Whenever I close my eyes. It's okay. I understand it's hard. You should do what you can while coping with your grief. Of course, you also need to make sure you aren't injured in the process. Caleb and your grandmother would want you to take good care of yourself. After the explosion, your cardiac function index significantly increased. It's most likely a result of the metaflux. At least three months of rest and observation are required, but your circumstances call for me to make an exception. Seeing your current state, I regret discharging you early. I just want to know why the explosion had to happen. Take it. <laughs> what is this? Your grandmother asked that I give it to you. However, whether or not now is a good time. In any case, perhaps this has the answers you seek. A letter? What else did Grandma say when she left the box with you? Just to give it to you. Now you have everything you need. Go home and rest. Doctor's orders. Wait, something's not right. You're imagining things. Off you go now. Never mind, I'll see you off myself. Wait for me outside. situation at hand. Concentrate. It's your turn. No problem. Keep your tempo. Eat this. Careless. Bring it off. Don't rush. Let's see what it's up to. Keep your distance from it. It's your turn. Nope. It is weak. Now's our chance. Keep your distance, or else you'll get hurt. Thanks. Here it comes. Get recovered. Be careful. Victory is within reach. Safety first. Keep your distance from it. It's your turn. No problem. Eat this. Seize this chance. Let's do this together. Okay. Here it comes. Leave it to me. Is this what you want? Perfect. Watch where it's going. Don't let your guard down. Keep your tempo. It's your turn. Nope. It is weak. Now's our chance. It is falling apart. It's not even a challenge. Is Oxo Hospital's flux stabilizer broken or something? How did a wanderer manage to get in? <sighs> Your hand! 
Your evil is... Do you need help? Keep your distance. Zane, you... You seem like you also need a doctor, huh? I hope such a person exists. Still, if this is a super important thing, why didn't Grandma give it to me sooner? I guess I'll never be able to ask her now. I'm going home. You don't need to come with me. I want to be alone for a while. Diseases and accidents are inevitable. Some leave this world whether they want to or not. <sighs> Don't stay trapped in the same place. Wait, are you trying to make me feel better? If it comforts you, even for a moment, then... Yes, I am. Your condition is serious. No more delaying treatment. <sighs> the time has come. The heavens have been more than kind to someone like me. <sighs> Do you remember what you promised us? If the worst case scenario happens, please take care of her on my behalf. You know, by helping her, you help yourself. Even so, it shouldn't have come to this. <sighs> <sighs> 